Hello, everybody. Welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Guild of Ascension, a hybrid turn-based strategy and real-time action roguelike, uh, which is the concept that sold me on checking this out. It comes out in about, about a week. We got the ability to check it out super early, which I'm super thankful for. I want to pop in because there's no menu music, and I want to... It always creeps me out. Okay, good. We got music. All right. Well, let's check it out. Welcome. Let us guess you are here to attempt the ascension, aren't you? Not. <laughs> hmm. Seen others like you. They did not make it far. We shall see. First things first, grab a weapon from the rack. We cannot let you in the tower empty-handed. Choose well. That will be the weapon that you carry in the tower. Carry in the tower, at least for your first attempt. Okay. Sword and shield, well balanced, easy to learn. It seems kind of like it's being explained like take this for the first run. Bow attack to distance, perfect to stay far away. Hammers are slow and mighty, deal massive damage to a single target if you perfect your timing during a turn. Oh my god, do we have like Paper Mario style action combat? You know what? Let's hit the hammer. Goes for you as well. Grab a weapon, lest you want to be left behind. Choose whichever feel good. You'll get to try other weapons, better weapons, as you progress into the tower. Oh my god, look at this man! Okay, so we get... Alright, uh, you know what? Let's take everything but the beginner one, because I'm a fool. Before we start, we want to offer you a precious item. It is our famous Towerpedia. It includes all the knowledge you will need about the tower and its mechanics. We've also included a chapter on how to use your weapons. Have a look at it. If you wonder what you can do. All right. Includes all the info you need on the in-game mechanics. Okay. It's section about weapon type. It includes details on all the attacks and skills you can perform. Okay. Fair enough. Is that in lieu of a tutorial? I like what I see here. Before we let you enter the tower, you must see if you are ready. Okay. Uh, that is why we have prepared a test for you. Nothing too hard, don't worry. One last thing before you start, we need you to sign this waiver. You know, just in case. All right, WASD to move around. And we are on, like, a... We're on a grid, and it's sort of like... Okay, yeah, so we have to press for a little bit to kind of confirm that we're moving to the next tile. Gotcha. Just want to make it clear that, that does this does not feel bad. This is me, like, intentionally trying to stay in this, in this square there. So, okay, that gives us a little bit of time. All right. Reach the target cells. In we go. Okay. Target cell back down here. Interesting. So I wonder how the... Yeah, how the planning... Alt to toggle the camera. Oh, ooh. Ooh. Presser hold. Use your combo attack. Okay. Fair enough. Hold and release to charge. Ooh, baby. Okay. Send him to the moon. All right. <laughs> then just do a dinky little one to see if we can. Escape to open the pause menu. Go to the Tower Pita tab. Select the weapon type category. Uh, okay. All right. So I have to... I cannot click it. Towerpedia. Not you discovered. Okay. There we go. Ah, we. I see. When we clicked over there, we immediately clicked into that list. Gotcha. Hammer. Cut base attacks combo. Deal 15% attack. Gain 20 skill points. Okay. Uh, charge. Do two to 45 to 90% attack. I'm assuming that's over the course of the charging process. Rest to gain 12 dodge points per second. Is that something that everybody gets to do? I had a feeling. Taunt is something that everybody can do as well. Oh, but they all do different things. Aggro the first enemy in front of you. Aggro all enemies around you. Kick the enemy in front of you. Okay. To aggro it and push it away. So we make it so they try and charge at us. Okay, so our combo... So we have skill attacks, triple hit, deal 60% attack in three rapid hits, 40% attack, hit times five, move back three cells. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll see how uh, how they get. Maybe they get more complex. All right. Hold shift to see the skill panel. And then one, two, three, four to trigger the skills. So this is the triple hit. 
this should be the... Ah, okay, so it's an AoE as well. I did not even see that aspect. Okay, so that's the roll back, and then we have that which we can't do, so we're going to have to sit and restore our energy, I guess, or is it just that we're not close enough? Fill the, spe uh, the skill point gauge to max. Fair enough. Whoop! Beep. So what is it seem it seems like maybe if we go, just do the regular combo that fills the uh that fills that up a little bit more. Okay. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit more. Hit the dummy with any skill. Okay. So we probably shouldn't have <laughs> gone in to do the most expensive one, but we can do that. Swap into this one there with the triple. Seems like it might do something else as well. All right. Cool. Oh, there's our other character. Ooh, 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 look at that. I love that little visual down there too. Okay. So like a pierce or something? No? Just do a dinky one, why not? They're just letting us, uh, letting us try out all of our different abilities there. That one is our pierce. Got like what looks like a little bit of a grenade. Okay, it does an AOE at the target. Okay. Oh, that that is a satisfying sound effect right there. Don't know what that is. Looks like it maybe put us into a little bit of invulnerability. So we have to do what? How do we how do we get over? Oh, we have to use the arrow keys. Oof. Weapon type. Uh Oh, teleport to the selected cell. Okay. Auto aim. Fire. Oop. Air steel 20%. Auto aimed. Gotcha. All right. Charge that bad boy up. And I imagine those would hit things no matter where we are. Okay. Space to gain dodge points. When hit, you will spend dodge points to avoid incoming attacks. Okay, so since we have that meter, if we didn't have enough, then we would not dodge it. Gotcha. Good enough. That'll do. Okay. Once you enter the tower, the goddess will challenge you by placing magical constructs in your way. You'll not be able to rest between rooms, but a good meal should give you back some of your energy. Your challenge is to push up as far... As far up the tower as you possibly can, if you're defeated at any time, simply send you back outside, healing your wounds and rewarding you based off of your achievements within the tower. We managed to recreate a small encounter based off of the rules right here. Do not be afraid to give it your best. Fights within the tower are turn-based. Only the active air active character can start actions. Okay, wait. Th so yeah, this is going to be the very unique aspect, I, I imagine, here. Fights within the tower are turn-based. Only the active character can start actions. At the beginning of your turn, you have a few seconds to think about what to do. If you wait too long, or if you initiate an action, your active turn will start until you run out of time. Until you run out of time. Okay. The enemy UI will display their next action. This provides a useful hint for how to handle the situation. Make sure to learn all the moves that each enemy can perform. So we have time to think here. He's going to do like some kind of an attack. I don't know. But not if I kill him first. I mean, I feel like that's not going to be, that was not going to be a, a tough situation there. All right, fair enough. I mean, we, do, we can just, we can just sit and wait. I'm thinking we're waiting for a, an enemy to show up. Not bad. Now let's add some challenge. Thank you. Different enemies will use different attacks. Try and memorize them and dodge them. You can hold control to zoom out while using tactics view to see more info on the enemies. You can see their turn order, attack and defense values, as well as their threat zone. Hold F to speed up the enemy animations. Cool. All right. So, oh, this is, yeah, th this does not turn out to be a, a lot of time to attack. So we, we are acting. We only have so much time here. We want to get her back over there okay get you away and go for a little bit of attacks here oh my god oh this is sick wait a minute wait a minute okay because you want to be really optimal with like your little combos and everything i'm gonna get you over here 
because we have started to act. It's just important to me that we get you out of here. Get you close, just in case this is not alive at the... Or this is still alive at the end of things. I mean, we're going to get tougher enemies. We're going to need to utilize those combos and everything. Oh, that's clever. This is neat. You seem ready now. We'll wait for you at the village. That's where you can access the tower. Welcome to our village. How do you like it? We try to make it warm and cozy. The tower is just behind us. You will be ready to go in a second. Normally, we would introduce you to all the merchants. But with no senders in a while, they had to go explore the tower themselves. They surely got lost. While you're inside, if you could look for them, that would be most helpful. Ooh, all right. Okay. Wiki Granny... I don't know what that... What, <laughs> there was multiple things there. Hold on. Ye who enter my forest, be warned. This way is most perilous. Search under each vine, defeat every foe. And only then may the path lead you up. May the forest be with you, my children. Campfire is your central hub and the only place you can always visit within the tower. From there, you can explore the floor, leave the tower, use items in your kit, or spend experience to level up. Come here as often as you think is necessary. When you level up, you must choose what kind of upgrade you prefer. The built-in options will automatically increase based off the corresponding stats. You can choose to increase different stats between your two characters. Okay, so all of these... All the options we have right here are all just fights, so I'm good to go. Let's do it. I'm I'm hyped. This is this seems sick. Defeat all enemies present. Uh, do we want to change our turn order? I think that's fine as is. All right. I mean, why why think here? Can we do our active? Nice. We got it in before the timer. When you defeat enemies, you'll gain experience points or XP. The total of each character's XP is displayed next to their level. Okay. Use the XP of the statue to level up, increase your power. Fair enough. Nice. Okay. Okay. Goddess intervention off, repost off. What the dang? Privileges grant bonuses to their owner. Some may even break the tower's rules. That is always music to my ears in a roguelike. Break the rules, please. More, please. Uh, when you receive a privilege, you must decide which of your characters will benefit from it. They can only hold a set number of privileges at a time, shown by the slots on the player UI. Increase your dodge, dodge stat by four. When resting, your adjacent partner will also recover dodge points or increase your defense stat. Let's put a defense up on her, since she's going to be up more in the melee range a little bit. Like, we have a very clear frontliner and backliner. Uh, is there a way to... There's no way to view the board better. Until now, I mean... I know we should probably think more. Did I get the ability off? I did. Good. Alright. So, it seems like it lets you... Uh... Yeah, it lets you go a little bit over the limit. And if you charge, it cuts you off right at the last second. Obviously, these fights are not hard in the slightest, but I can only imagine that is not going to be the case. Killing an enemy adds two seconds to your turn. Hmm. Run speed up. Max charge attacks has a 25% chance to stun. Oh, okay. So this is getting kind of clever. Uh, we'll have her get up there uh, in melee range faster. That's like half of her turn. Oh, wow. This is... So we might want to go for the piercing attack on the, um... Might want to go for the piercing attack on the archer. We don't have to start immediately. Like, go up there, uh, and that's his his shift left click. Yeah. Uh-oh. I hope it doesn't matter. Okay. That was nice. Nice, 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 nice. I know we could have taken time. I think you can take time on each character's turn to, to go for that, right? Killing an enemy. At, I mean, probably shouldn't be adding everything to the same character, but I'm a sucker. Shop goddess statue. What was the goddess statue? Did we did, wait? Did we know what this was? This was the oh, this is the XP. We can gain a super meal at the campfire, gain a respawn potion, or. Each ascender gains 100 experience. Sure. We'll do we'll do that. All right. So where was the campfire? That was here. So we can go here whenever we want. 
What was this about? Level up. Okay. Current level one. Consume? Whoop! Select increased style. Balanced, aggressive, defensive, or custom. Ooh. Stat importance. What do we want to do with that? So if we, if we buff up one, then all of them go down a little bit. By, and it's it's pretty substantial. Like, because we go up by 2%. So we gain 2% value and we lose 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We lose 5% value on that. I don't know if it's like we're at a 0. 0.5 though. It's probably, it, it, maybe it's like, maybe they're actually at like 16.5 because they don't change when you do this, you know? I feel like we don't need more time with her as much the way we're going to be playing her right now. Uh, let's get some attack and defense. I like that we... I like that you can go all in like this if you really want to. Uh, I don't think it's a good call. But also, it sounds funny. Get a little bit more HP. Critical, I couldn't care less i can't put i can't put one of them down by specific uh, like on on purpose i can't lower one but i could raise everything but that if that's something i don't care about like we could also yeah just do it in a way where it's like no no dodge all defense and attack just say who cares about uh the rng of it all there's got to be a better way to do this though 27, 27, 5. S stupid. I don't know. I, I, I'm curious. That's, that's so wild. What a funny way to do it. But hey, we'll rock this. You know, you can be... Uh, you can care a little bit less about your defense and stuff. We'll go for attack, critical, and time. In fact, getting more time especially sounds interesting there. Attack and time as a priority. And you'll be a frail boy. With a little bit of dodge. Yeah, we'll, we'll up dodge too. Dodge, attack, and time. No, Nothing in critical. Basically. Okay, that's a lot of... Yeah, there's a lot of specific customization there. Anything in the kit? We could eat a meal... Each center regens 25 HP. Don't need it right now. Explore tower. Probably going to go for that. Of course. Like, sure. All right. So there's the shop. I, let's do another fight here. Okay. This is actually prime target for Whirlwind. Which is shift two. Oh, no. We actually can't be there. Uh, let's take a look. Is there... A Maybe if we look at the hammer for a second, is there a way to see if we hit multiple targets at all? Because it doesn't, there, nowhere does it say that tornado hits in an AOE. You know what I'm saying? Like obviously we can take a take a guess at it. Okay, you were able to sneak that in. Okay. Oh wait. Oh yeah. Look at that. That was a. That was quite a bit more time. But we can. We can. It'll be a guarantee that we get this hit. But that's right. We have the dodge. It's amazing. Just get out of here. Doesn't matter. See you later, sucker. Increase your dodge stat by four. You know what? Let's just increase your de defense even more. We we we've got some clear favoritism. Show me a challenge. What you got? Destroy all the dummies present within the time limit. As this character, okay. Oh, uh-oh. It's a very, very l slow move there. But if we do it when they're at full... Oh, there's more! Well, I wouldn't have locked myself in place had I known. I did not know there was going to be more coming. Rip. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, I did. Okay, it was about the first, it was the first two. Okay, that was confusing. 
I don't know what the hell happened there. <laughs> Check out a random event. A dense fog makes you feel dizzy. Each ascender loses 20 HP. Oh. Well, okay. You found a strange shield in the stone. Gain defense plus. Sure. Get the key. Hello, lovelies. Are you new are you new ascenders coming to explore the tower? Such great news have been it's been too long since someone tried it for real. I used to explore the tower when I was younger, but now I only manage to get lost in it. Well, at least I'm still pretty good at blacksmith. Come by my forge when you get out of here, and before I forget, here's a thing I found. You might need it to progress. Thanks. Thanks, grandmother. Alright, so we have a couple... Let's see here. Ooh, we'll do another fight here. Sure. Yeah, I can't see the... I can't see the layout that well based off of that. I'm gonna go... Down... Do a little bit of smack into super duper smack. That might be enough. That's enough. Good. And then for you, I think we go up here and we do the piercing. Oh, whoop. I didn't get to read that. I was busy pressing my other button. Shoot. It's okay. You got you got the armor there. Not too worried. What did it say? Oops, I wanted to just... I wanted to see what that was about. Oh! Okay, we got our move in. It's alright, it's alright. It's right. Boar Crusher. Nice. Alright. Maybe we can see that. I bet you we can see it on that escape menu thing still. I... There should be more of these. And maybe there will be when it's out. There could be when it's out. I'm a, I'm a crazy boy. What can I say? All right, so we had the other... We had the shop there. We had another path down here. Hmm. This one's a little weird. Yeah. Nah. Oh, no, that was a mistake. Oh, 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 no. Get a charge shot at the end. Oh, my God. Because we didn't start with it. So the energy does not stay between turns. Gotcha. It's okay. We can dodge that. That's no problem. Setting us up for an interesting whirlwind. Can we move diagonal? No. Oh, it moves us forward. Oh, okay. That's Now that's pretty cool. Nice. Okay, that that makes that move even cooler. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Give me some attack, sure thing. So, we probably have to go through the shop. Let's go back and get a little bit of level up in now. Oops. Hold on. Hold on. Back it up. Or wait. Are we, we're always passively leveling up. It's just if we wanted to... No? Hmm. Fine. We'll go balanced. We'll go balanced because I don't want to set it every time. Aggressive. I trust it. I trust the words aggressive to, to give me what I desire. Uh, sure. That that fixes the thing that happened in the mist. Okay. What do you got here? What are we doing here, you ask? Well, as you know, it can be pretty easy to get lost inside the tower, but a few years ago, we found a back entrance used by some tower constructs to do maintenance. As long as we don't enter a challenge room, the goddess seems to mostly ignore our presence. So we use this opportunity to set up a small mid-tower shop. Feel free to use what you found in your ascension. 
We only accept wishes here, as the tower seems to remove any other rewards if we don't partake in the challenges as well. What? Oh, okay, so here, oh, okay. So here's the little bit more interesting items. Killing an enemy grants you a temporary strength up status effect. Good old counterattack in front of you. Sounds good. All right, sounds good. Okay, so th there's the little bit more spicy ones. We got the key, so we should be able to do that. Yeah, we got that unlocked. All right. So it might be a better idea to go into these boss fights like with your stuff charged up. Hello there, mister. So the thing with this character is we can't then... Um... Okay. Can we attack through our ally? Oh my god, we're counterattacking because we were technically getting hit. Oh my god, that's broken. Uh, that is broken. Enemy repost. Enemy usually have a repost gauge fills with every hit they receive. The repost gauge decreases naturally with time. When it's filled, it'll turn red and they will... Okay. Trigger the enemy's repost move. Okay, which seems to be that. Oh, shoot. Well, I'm just going to keep on doing this over and 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 over. Because then maybe the enemy's going to come up and we'll hit him. Oh, shoot. Okay, so they did it like that. All right. Well, I just want to be up in melee range. I'm just... I'm fine with that. Because I wanted to get... Yeah! Okay. Okay. That's a weird, cheesy way to do it. We get an extra five damage for every uh, every melee there. It's a little... It's a little goof jank, but I adore it. Nice. Oh, he teleported to a new spot. Can we get there in time? No. Oh, we've already started to... Yeah, that was a mistake. We shouldn't start moving until we know what we're going to do. Yeah, that's going to hit us both, isn't it? No, he went for that. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, we're fine. We've got this easy. Ah, the repost, though. Okay. Oh, what? Okay, so that's real time there. And he's leaving grass wherever he goes. This should be fine. I mean, it's the first. It's the first boss. He's a he's a little bit of a pushover, but we are exceptionally gnarly. We started to take some damage because we lost our um, our dodge there. You got the floor amulet. Unspent wishes. Two point six. All right. You made it through the first floor. How was it? Do not get overconfident. It was only the training area. The goddess likes to set the stage for newcomers. We wish you the best for what is to come. Quite impressive. Exiting the tower intact like you did is a feat few have done before you. Remember this for ages. Thank you. Got Granny Smith rescued. I've opened my shop. Now come see me for new weapons. Okay, cool. Wow, that's quite the exploit. <laughs> Don't know how many people can fell an enemy in one blow. Think you can do this again? Yeah. Congrats. <gasps> Fishing rod weapon. Okay, now I'm jazzed. Congrats. Okay. Wow, we got so much stuff. Nighttime. Charms, kits, pets. Pets? Kits? Oh, this stuff. Okay. And it looks like there was more, yeah, more charms to unlock too. Sounds very neat. Where's the fishing rod? So these are just better. Is there anything else about them? They're just they're just better. Where's the fishing rod? Okay, we don't have any of these things. Whatever the heck them's them's are. Oh wait, this is the fishing rod. It looks like a bow. That's why. Okay. Ah, ah, I see, I see. Fine, I will buy a, I will buy the fishing rod. Yes. And the hammer, sure. 
why not, man? Sure. There's no other charms to buy. Nothing else to spend money on. And we got probably one more run thing in us. So what what was the other stuff here? We get we unlock things if we get a flawless victory. We unlock stuff if we gain a total of 75 wishes. That's his requests. Oh, and everybody has their own requests. Da Vinted. Impala. We don't, don't know them. Reach 85 points in attack for a single ascender. I mean, that is my jam. Okay, so there's like different submissions per floor. That's kind of nifty. In total of 300 experience points, 225 points in HP for one ascender, six privileges for one ascender. I would do that on accident, man. Obtain the floor amulet. I mean, we'll probably defeat 10 enemies. All right, all right, all right. Well, I mean, let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. So, at the goddess statue, we, we can't, like... Yeah, all right. So, we do start back at zero. Good. All right, good. I want. I wanted to, for what it's worth. Okay, explore. Let's go. XP. Huh. Defeat all the enemies. Hmm. Don't know what these things are. They look like landmines. Okay. If we can get this one down, we might be able to do a little bit of a attack into piercing attack deal here. Okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. We should be able to dodge this with no problems. Gotcha. All right. Peasy. Goddess Intervention is on. I don't know what that means. Okay, so there's the XP. We did not get offered one of those passives. Let's go get one of those passives. Why the heck not? Oh my god, this is... Definitely a one of these. Just disgusting. Just disgusting. Oh, every third attack. Okay, so there's another neat one. Uh, every third attack, your partner will perform a basic attack in front of them. Let's go with the base. Just like straight up attack attack. But that is cool. I like that one. Conceptually, I like it a lot. All right. That, uh, we might be able to break that mine too, which is nice. Oh, we didn't even get another attack in. Ooh, it's like a Bomberman one. Ooh. Okay. All right, this is all fine. Uh, do we need to... What, what does the R do again? Oops. No, no, no. The keyboard controls leave a little bit to be desired. I know it says, it's like, you know, play with whatever I... Uh, keyboard. Kick the enemy in front of you, aggro it, and push it three cells away. That's right. I don't think I need to. Quick, quick, quick. Yes, we got it in. Nice, 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 nice. Enemy repost is on now. It was not before, so the threat level went up. This is actually... I, I want to try that out. It seems very fun. Let's do another XP before we go back to level up. I just... I'm that kind of guy. I don't want to just sit and... Oh, my God. They're... Absolutely none of them line up. That sucks. It's okay. We'll have to go about it a different way. Okay. It's not going to be a kill. We, we, oh, we hit the, uh, the retaliation. Okay. We need to thank here. Uh, uh. So every, we're going to just attack as many times as possible. Cause I was trying to, I was trying to get the kill there. That's clever though. Ooh, we are going to start to take some damage. Okay. So he went to just sit there for a little bit. We're probably going to get, yep. 
Uh, oh, this is turning sour. Like, I want to do the, the whirlwind. But are we going to... Well, actually, no, it's in a plus formation. So we're fine to do a whirlwind. Nope! <laughs> it pulls us forward after! I didn't think that we were going to be... We're too strong when we don't want to be. Okay, so it's fine. So we know their, their retaliate is just a thing right in the front there. Okay. When would we want to go for a charge instead of a regular? So what happens here? So she's just dead? I mean, I think that there was like a revive we could get right back here. Yes. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, so things, yeah, things took a, uh, the, with the repost on, things took a gnarly turn for the, uh, for the worse. We should have probably gotten our... Oh my god. Just let me click the shrine. Let me just click the actual shrine. Yeah, we should have done that already. Let's get a defensive kind of a build then going for you. We'll go defensive on you and we will go... Ooh. We'll go aggro on you. Okay, that's a big level up. Okay. To deal with this one again if we see it here super meal respawn okay so <laughs> yeah now now it's a little bit spicier i don't know which one we want to go for let's go for the exp i'm a greedy boy i'm a greedy boy does 100 do it for us yes it does oh my god 100 like really does it for us we'll go balanced on this one i'll tell you what since we've gotten so much level ups there up to seven we are still going to go aggressive on this one. Definitely still going aggro on that one. XP. Let's go ahead and get an item. We need a we need a bunch more items still. Okay. What's that negative thing about it? It's a negative 15. As if it mattered that I was hitting her. Oh my god, what? It came down from space. Gonna probably actually take damage. We did not take damage. That's handy. Uh. It's okay, we're gonna do this, and then we're probably gonna spin out of here. They're gonna come back down there? Really? I'm gonna be close because I wanna be I wanna take the hit if we if it comes to, you know? If it comes to, it comes to. Oh my god. I was hoping they would target me instead, but they were in space. Oh We need to get some defense stuff. So you already what happens if we got two of those then? What would that really do for us? Am I supposed to go back and level up again? Like, yeah, I will say I don't like that. Oh, oh, okay. So, okay, good. I was gonna say if, if it's like every time we come back we get a level up. Gotcha. I do wish we could just like do it on the fly though. I think that would be better. Let's definitely go to the shop. We need all the help we can get right now. Killing enemy adds two seconds. Run speed. Max charge attacks have a twenty-five percent chance of afflicting stun. I am a little bit more interested in now. A little bit more interested in now. What is this? Symbol. What is it? Oh my god. What is the plan here? I think that'd be good. Okay. Um, 
so there's the three. We got the kill. Good. 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 We take that. That's good enough. That's good enough. That's good enough. I wanted to line her up so that she would get the repost there. Is that enough range? Not enough range. Good. Good, 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 good. Love to see. Uh... Nope. Actually, wait. We bring them with us? Ooh. Also, is there any way I can see... That one thing that we didn't get to see about the, uh, no, it's not look like it. Controls, visual, game. It just, yeah, it threw it in while we were, like, in the middle of doing attacks. Oh, run. I'm assuming it's, like, gives us some kind of, it's got to give us something. Ah, it slows us down. There. And I think charge doing the charge last so you can guarantee you get a squeeze in as much as possible. That's kind of nice. Oh, is that the the wishes? That might be wishes. Also, I'm certainly seeing some benefit in um yeah, we're going full defensive there. In splitting up who takes damage. Since we, our heals are AoEs, you know what I'm saying? Like, they heal everybody. There's another shop. Fine. We'll just do it. Hot take. Oh, hey, new stuff. After resting your adjacent partner, we'll also, we should probably also rest more, I guess. Attacks have a 10% chance of inflicting burn. Sounds good to me. Sounds very neat. Very neat, very neat. Whoa. We need her out of the way. Uh, okay. Uh, it's pretty clear what I'm doing. I just want to make sure we... Okay. a lot of burn there so when we hit him he does the charge okay that sage is gonna come down right on us bear's gonna sit that's fine don't care chance to stun on full swing sure oof Not bad. Could have been could have been way better, could have been way worse. Now we're gonna see some problems here. We're gonna see some big problems here. Alright, um Let's rest. Okay, so you can really you can definitely rest and get stuff in there. Okay. That that's a big difference maker. That's a big difference maker. Okay. Because that dodge should save us. Yes, it did. Full charge. Okay, okay, okay. I'm definitely seeing the, the extra layers of strategy now within the dodging aspect. I, for some reason, I thought it was an all or nothing, but it's really not. That's, a, that's very important. Dodge friendly attacks. Dodge friendly attack. Oh my god. It was losing dodge points is what it was doing. Wait, so do you not lose health, but you lose you would lose dodge points? Oh my god. Okay, well <laughs> Okay. That make it makes sense. Hello there. Come here to help me, please. I'm testing this new device in the tower. Last 22 times it exploded, but I'm sure this time it worked. Oh, no. Well, maybe it's time to go back home and do some more computation. At least I found this curious item in case it could be helpful to you. Floor key, of course. Fair, 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 fair. It's a challenge. Of course, we can 
handle a challenge at 2 HP. Oh, we don't have the level up. No, sir. All right. Uh, yeah, some some indi maybe there's an indicator somewhere. Is it? Oh, is it down there? Is it? Would that show like that we can level up? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Let's do a regular fight here. XP as a reward. Nobody's cleanly lined up. Putting our archer in the grass might be okay because then they have to run a little slower to get to them. Alright. I'm okay with this. I thought we had enough energy, but it didn't. Go! Oh, okay, we'll take it. We'll take those. We'll take those. We'll take those. We'll take those. Oof. Please don't be able to... Nice. That that helps a lot, actually. Okay. Um. I think I could... I think I can get a kill. And then heal up. Nope. Nope. All right, uh... For some reason I thought... Okay, that's not good. Yep! Understatement of the century. I thought... I thought that attack is so slow. It, make, it makes sense. It makes sense. And we got to get a charge shot in because otherwise you were going to run away. It makes sense that it would be so slow. It's a hammer. Makes me very... I'm, like, super curious about the sword fighter. And I'm super curious about if there's, like... You know, let's throw a bomb for once. Yeah, it's kind of kind of what I figured. It's a, it's a situational item for a situation we're not in. And then run. All right, we're going to be fine. Goddess intervention. During the fight, the goddess may intervene to activate a random event. Can be good or bad. It'll be displayed at the bottom of the screen. The effect targets a specific character. Its icon will be displayed with an appropriate... Icon. Spawns a pickup that will unlock your skill points to max? Oh, oh. Skill points, for some reason, I don't know why I was thinking of it as a different thing. Alright, well, we got no chance about, you know, of winning this with no other character, but... You know? It's all mine! Maybe we'll get some kind of a revive. Found a camp, extra meal, not what I needed. Invited to play dice? Always scamble. I wonder if there's a way to know. There is, and I did. I, I, it was me. I did it. Okay, what do I win? A hundred wishes. Great. These are all great things that I can totally benefit from. Don't have a revive. We don't need our meal. Do you at least get all the experience? I feel like you really do benefit from time, but I need something. Oof. Oof, boo, oof. Okay, uh, where to? There, And there is, like, there is literal power upgrades that we can buy at home, too, which is interesting. Uh, wishes or... Let's go... Whatever. You know, it might not be an enemy challenge. Last challenge was not... Break all the bases. Okay. Oops. Oh. Uh-oh. Nice. That's a satisfying sound. What? Uh. Nah, that's, that's, I couldn't... Uh, I couldn't turn in time. I won? So you must... It must be a modular reward. Like, the more you do... The better you do, the better the reward. That makes sense. That must be what it is. Should we just try and do the boss, actually? 
Thank you. Let me click it. Let me click it. Uh. Alright. Is it enough to get us a level up? Ah, well. You got me excited for nothing. Oops. It's okay. It's probably for the best. Oh, gee, what turn order do I do for my inevitable demise? Actually, if we... If we get all the way, like, up in the corner here... Oh. I think we have, like, a chance of doing some good. You're... You got a range move. You can make it all the way to me. That sucks. Move to the left, please. Hmm. That works out really well, actually. We got all our skills back, too. Okay. You're probably going to move to the left. No, you did not move to the left. All right. Um, what is our big boy move? Big boy move. I'm assuming it's just like, do a lot of damage. Oh, that's right. That's right. Fire eight arrows that do 20% attack. What's the range? Okay. We're probably going to take an attack here, but we can dodge one. No, we didn't even. We got this. Nothing. Oh, it shoots. That sucks. Got his intervention. Thank you. Oh, screw off. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, wait. That per- she, They died in the air from the fire. Oh my god, they died in the air from the fire. That's incredible. Alright, 43 X XP cubes. Is that enough to get a level? Oh, bite my butt. Yeah, I don't like the fact that we have to come back just to figure out if we- like, I, don't get me wrong, I want to make it clear. I love this. I'm loving this. I'm adoring this so much. I don't like the backtrack to, to there to press the button to see it, to see if... Like, it'd be one thing. It'd be, it'd be only kind of annoying if we had to come back every time to level up uh, when we knew for sure that we had it. The fact that we have to go back and we don't know if we have it or not is... Ooh, spooky. All right. Let's check it. Don't know what his attack is. Shoot. Okay, so these... They back... Oh, they backtrack like that. That's... Okay. I thought it was they backtrack away from me. No, that is not the case. They backtrack away in the direction they're looking, which is actually very good for this. Okay. I don't know what these do. Okay, so you have a straight line attack. You're on fire already. Okay. Spawns to pick up the grants your extra XP. I mean, like, I want. Don't get me wrong. I want to. You gotta admit that was a beautiful shot. And then I put myself in line for an attack. Ooh, wait. Different attack. You gotta admit that was beautiful. Genius work, though. Maybe we can use these to our advantage. Maybe they can attack through them. I 
bet you I can pierce them. I can pierce through them. But it also breaks them. I feel like he can run all the way up and then do the line pierce shot. Okay, maybe he can, but he didn't. I'm at a loss, man. Well, we're dead. I, I was at a, I was trying to think of it. There was no like really good shot there that I could find. God's intervention. Why? Probably unnecessary. Ooh, not good. Just trying to get my trying to use these things to my advantage here. Oh. God, that is just brutal. Oh, I was trying to get one shot off to do a little bit of fire. Do you have you can't do that attack every time, can you? That, that feels like that would be too strong. Okay. He <laughs> spawned it and killed it. That works fine. That was absolutely twisted of him, though. So if he does a retaliation strike, does it hit allies? That's my question. That move is just too much for me. All right, goddess intervention. I would love that. Oh, not good. Okay, wait. He's doing that instead of a different attack, though. Okay. Oh, God. Nope, none of that worked how I wanted. None of that worked how I wanted. I, I did not hit him fast enough to get that proc. I did not hit him fast enough for the proc. We're dead here. Oh, we're fine. Never doubted it for a second. Okay. Just, I mean, what do we do? We freaking run. No way you can get to me. I would, sh I would just lose my mind. Summon, he can summon another wolf, wolf, wolf alchemy. Can we charge? Okay, we can charge it on the bushes. That's huge. I hope that wolf can't get to me. Okay. It's fine. We, we, it's okay. If wolves get summoned and they can't attack me on turn one, it's not that big of a deal. We can get a piercing shot off. Oh, that sucks. Regen 100% dodge. Ooh. That's problematic. Yeah, we're going to get wolf chomped. That's problematic. That was not a good idea. We're dead here. But hey, we, we did a pretty good job considering we had no other, uh, no other ally here. We did a really good job, all things considered. In my humble opinion. In my humble opinion. All right, we got Nature's Wrath. Your weapon ain't good enough to knock down the enemies. Bring me some materials. I'll make you one of the most robust ones you've ever seen. Okay, we got the Oathbreaker. Last Remnant. Need more protection over to find us. Okay. More gold. I mean, we, it seems like we did great. It seems like, yeah, it seems like we did as well as it probably would have expected I, I do, anyways. So we could unlock this sword as well. Like, that's good to know. And there is just straight up a, an, an upgraded one with an extra two crit value, extra damage there. Fair. Initial HP up by an extra 10. Yeah, like this stuff makes a pretty big, pretty big difference there. We have kits. We can start with a different kit. Maybe. No, it looks like we'll, we will be able to start with a different kit. Gotcha. So this is just like the meta progression stuff. It's really, it's just a different way of it being visualized. 
Uh, but yeah, the, the idea that a character could... Um, like, the addition of a different weapon set in this game, like a different, like, actual full-on weapon set in this game, is kind of, like, massively ground sh ground or uh, ground-shakingly big impact on how the game plays out. If you add one new one new move set which is really neat uh yeah there's a lot of like there's some rough edges that i hope get you know sanded off stuff like that like control things like uh, a little bit of the ui uh i feel like could 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 be brought up to the whimsical nature and colorful nature of the other art styles and stuff in the game uh, i think would be nice uh being able to see the see the board from the ground or top from top down uh before you, like, basically launch out your characters would be huge. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I just, this is a super cool idea. I, and, uh, like, obviously just, yeah, more more items, more stuff like that. Obviously, if, if the end of the room items that you get to pick from, I, I can see now why uh, those ones are not super advanced, super crazy, because you could just get a million of those, and then, like, you could be super wild kitted out if they were super niche and cool but still yeah i hope that there are a lot more uh cooler like some like some of the ones that we saw in the shops uh for those items i hope that there are more more like that um and yeah like i don't know a new a new weapon set even entirely like it's a as if the game gets updates post post launch or whatever i think it might be launching into early access i am checking here uh, don't recall. Don't know here. I actually don't know if it's going to be launching into early access or not, but I really like it. I like it a lot. Uh, but alas, very much enjoyed. Uh, highly recommend you wishlist this. Check it out. Uh, see what's changed when it comes out in a week uh, from this early early release version everything like that i'm honestly i could i might play more i really liked it i actually it's very very novel uh the turn-based into action i i really really like it like feeling like you have to squeeze that stuff in in the time limit you have to make the most of your time i really like that idea and like that it makes it so those those turns where the situations where i had like that the fact that i can remember the one move i did whereas like there was the wolf and I, I hit him twice to, so I could line him up with the other arrow. As you get more time, like, you can do stuff like that more often. Like, th that thing, that turn, made me really excited about it. I was like, okay, the, these these kits are not wildly complex, but when you're working with this time constraint and they are, you know, you have these different passives and things you can get, it, it does open up a lot of really interesting, cool turns that can happen. Uh, but yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd like to see how this gets updated. I, I really, really enjoyed it. Very much enjoyed it. I, I think it's going to be great. Thank you, thank you. My name is Retromation. Put up videos on indies and more with an extra specialty in roguelikes. So if you enjoy the genre, if you enjoy indies, you're kind of doing, uh, doing yourself a disservice if you ain't subscribed. You're going to miss out on so many cool things. I mean, it's free and you can just, like, unsubscribe later. <laughs> you know? Like, just... Get cool games in your YouTube sub box. If you if you don't want it anymore, just go go ahead and unsubscribe. It's fine. Like obviously, I hope you don't, but you know you can do it. Just thank you, thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye.